What's up YouTube welcome to another video and this particular video I'm going to talk about a new trick through which you can utilize and view your Wi-Fi password. So there are many reasons you want a Wi-Fi password to be viewed. Either you lost your password for your own Wi-Fi and your device is connected with your Wi-Fi but you just forget the password of your device. The other reason might be that you have a Wi-Fi which is already connected in your office or in your school and your friend wants that password and you don't know the password of that device or you want to share that particular password but you can't remember so there is a simple trick which you can follow and this trick will help you to view your password quite easily so before going into the video if you're new here on the channel a sub will be massively appreciated so guys so let me show you how you can do this in the wi-fi setting you just need to open up your wi-fi and you will see that i am already connected with the tp link wi-fi after pressing the tp link button another screen will pop up and this screen has a qr code there are two possibilities either the other device can be connected using this qr code or there is another option so uh, you just need to do is uh, take a screenshot of that device since i am using the samsung galaxy note 9 you just need to press the power button and volume down button to get the screenshot for that particular screen next what you are going to do is you just need to open up your google and type in zing zing dot org uh, i have also put the link of that website in the description you can check there as well and after opening up that website you just need to do is upload that screenshot which you have taken so after uploading the screenshot you will just need to submit the button and boom you will see your wi-fi password is there mine is 54675308 and you can also find your password there but keep in mind one thing that this trick only worked on android 9 and upwards if you have a device which is running on android 9 or android 8 or below this trick will not work over there so you have to follow the traditional old method which is to root your device for those particular software so guys thanks for watching this video i hope this video gives you some information and if you like this video a sub will be massively appreciated i will meet you in the next one peace out